Bible reveals a connection between faith and hope. That means if you have faith, you are going to be hopeful about the future. And the reason for that is very simple. We have a wonderful future. What am I referring to? The kingdom of God. And in the book of Revelation, we learn about events. Events that will take place prior to the establishment of the kingdom of God. And we need to be ready for the kingdom. And that's why in Revelation chapters 2 and 3, there are seven specific messages to the believers. Things that we need to learn, things that God tells us in order that we will be found faithful and that we will be doing the things that God wants us to do in the last days. And I think it's very important that we find that we are called to be overcomers. Isn't that significant? That Messiah taught us that we are called to overcome. What are the things that we are called to overcome? And how do we find the wisdom and the strength to overcome these obstacles, these difficult times? Well, that is exactly our theme for a very special day. We're going to hold a conference in Cluj-Napoca on October 14th. It's a Saturday. There'll be two messages in the morning and two messages in the afternoon, and we will study the entire second and third chapters of the book of Revelation. Those seven messages for believers so that we learn how to behave in the last days. And it's only when we believe the right things will we then behave in a way that's pleasing to God. And that's what you and I should want to do, to be well-pleasing to God, to be found faithful, to be ready for these things. And in my opinion, there are prophetic signs that we are approaching the last days. So this one-day conference in Cluj is very important. So again, I invite you, make your reservations now for October 14th, four messages from those seven letters to those seven churches. And we'll see what Messiah says concerning his followers in the last days. Consider this your personal invitation to register and come to Cluj Saturday, October 14th for this conference. Hopefully, we'll see you then. Shalom.